All right, so here we're going to be going through and uh, next part of this video is making sure that the uh, wireless uh, connectivity is uh, working. <clears throat> this is the main issue that we were having with this unit. So we're going to go back into configurations. We're going to go ahead and hit network right there, network, and we're going to set up a Wi-Fi. So now here, scan it for the Wi-Fi list. Allow this to scan for the Wi-Fi list. Okay, nope, I do not need that. Press the wrong thing. Go backwards, it's gonna ask me for a password anyway. I'm gonna go back, exit out, scan again. Apologize about that. <clears throat> You're going to search for your network, your Wi-Fi uh, network that's uh, set up for this. So we're going to scroll down until we find the one that we're using. Okay. All right. We're going to do our password here. So, so go ahead and put your uh, password in there. Um, Client gave me two different ones to use. He wasn't sure of which one it was. So uh, if it's not the right one, I think it's gonna, it'll take a little bit longer because uh, it takes, it'll keep trying and keep trying to keep trying to connect. Uh, just for yourself, make sure that you do have the correct password that you are using um, to do it. I did this once before with the password and it didn't, uh, it didn't work. So hopefully I'm trying the new one. Relatively, if it goes through, it should go through relatively quickly. Also, too, I believe it's uh, it's case sensitive, so he gave me two of them and he told me to try different cases. So we'll get to this. We, got a, uh, we configured it properly. We have got the, the the correct code in here. As soon as you do that, um, everything should start right up. You can see the antenna here is connected. So we are looking good. You can actually also, I'm gonna be checking now, you can download the app. You can uh, download the uh, Hayward Omni app. Just go to your local app store or Google Play and look for, this one is the Omni Logic. So look for Hayward Omni Logic. You download that app and then you go through the settings uh, of your router. There's possibly like an email address or the username of your router plus your password. You go through all those settings on the app and then you're able to connect from the app to your system here, but you gotta do it at the system location first, like we just demonstrated here. So if you have any questions regarding this, please push the comments down below. Like and subscribe my page, hit the bell notifications, like my page. We got many more good things coming up. Thank you so much for watching this video.